Hello everyone, Jim Stroud here. It's been a while. Yes, it's been a while. And you know what? Um, the last time I saw some of you guys was at SourceCon, which was, wow, February? <laughs> I've been so busy, I'm losing track of time. But I had a great time at SourceCon. Great time at SourceCon. <laughs> Everyone there uh, was coming up to me and saying, "Jim, I love your show. It, was, it felt so good." You know, like, well, let me let me demonstrate what it was like. Okay, say this phone. Uh, this iPhone is me, and um, this hello kitty. <laughs> this uh, this phone here is uh, someone walking up to me as SourceCon, and 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 it, and it was like. Um, Hi, the Jim Stroud Show. Have you seen it? It's a wonderful show. I think you'll like this show, the Jim Stroud Show. It's great. It's watched by over 10 people every week. Uh, more or less. And it's a great show. It's a wonderful show. The host, oh, he's so funny. He's so amazing. Uh, you really would like the Jim Stroud Show. Okay, yes, it's me. It's me. And I love my show. And I want to tell you about my show. So you should come by and check out my show. I could probably... Now that I think about it, maybe I wasn't that popular. Okay, today for this episode of the Jim Straub Show, I'm going to focus on some really cool tools, uh, some Google Chrome extensions, actually, uh, that will make your sourcing lives uh, a bit easier. Now, this first tip came from um, a friend of mine. Who, who told me that? What's, was that source? Kind of what? Oh, yes, it was uh, my pal, Irina. Hi, Irina. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Frankie. Yeah, uh, it's me and Irina. Yeah. Um, okay, we were hanging out and we were trading tips, whatnot. And she mentioned this cool tool that I want to share with you guys. It's called Falcon. Uh, Falcon. Uh, the address is Falcon.io. Can you put the homepage? Yeah, you can uh, download it um, for to your browser from this uh, from their homepage. And this is basically how it works. It's really cool. Once you have Falcon installed in your Google Chrome browser, hop on over to Twitter. Make sure to click the Falcon icon. Now, once that is done, just simply mouse over a twiddle, a twiddle, uh, a Twitter alias, uh, for example, at Jim Stroud. And once you mouse over that alias, um, a Falcon will reveal other networks that at Jim Stroud is a member of. In this way, you get a broader picture of who at Jim Stroud is as a passive candidate. Okay, so that was pretty cool. The next tool I want to show you guys is called Who Works At. And uh, this is the home page for uh, the Chrome extension who works at right there. And basically how it works is you go to a company site, let's say uh, Microsoft company site there, yeah. And um, I come to the site and I go, hey, this is a cool company. I wonder you know, who I, if I know someone there. Uh, I could, could go over to LinkedIn or I could just uh, click on my uh, Chrome extension there for uh, who works at and then it will, it will show me, uh, with one click of the button, people that I already know, um, who people I'm connected to uh, who work at that company so sort of like sort of a preview of my LinkedIn connections right there on my browser without me having to Go to LinkedIn. It's it's right there. Really really convenient. I like it a lot cool tool ah! It's not time to do the shout out yet. That's, that's later in the show Do you know how to recruit on Facebook? Maybe you do, maybe you think you do, but you don't really. Well, either way, whether you do know how or think you know how or don't know how, I want to suggest to you that you check out this free webinar that's coming up next week on Facebook. The uh, details are on the screen there. Thank you, Frankie. Uh, details are on the screen, and uh, I will be there in attendance. I will not be giving the presentation. A uh, good friend of mine will, but um, I will be there in attendance checking it out because I've seen the technology ahead of time, and... Me likey. I think you will too. So uh, be sure to sign up. The URL is there on the screen. It's also in the video description down there. Yeah, down there. So uh, be sure to sign up and uh, cool. Okay. Um, now we will talk about Google Chrome history, a nifty little hack. Well, it's not really a hack. It comes with the Google Chrome browser. Uh, this is um, how I will use the Google Chrome history option on your Google Chrome browser. On a PC to access your history, simply click Control plus H. 
on a Mac, uh, you want to click the command button plus the letter Y. Now, once you've done that, you'll see a complete history of your online activity, at least your online activity that was done uh, while using the Google Chrome browser. I use my history primarily to track search strings I've used in the past, as shown here. And since all activities are also archived by uh, date and time, it helps me uh, keep track of hours that I spent on a project. Very handy. <laughs> Thank you so much. Talk to you soon.